Here we are at the Crescent Dunes Solar Energy Project in Tonopah, Nevada. This project, which is in the final phases of construction, has been a monumental achievement for establishing solar power as a reliable energy source that can provide electricity day and night. A few years ago, this project was nothing but an idea with a set of plans. Today, the project has come a long way with the installation of 10,347 heliostats that now surround the tower. By the time the project is completed, over two million hours of labor will have been put into this project. But that isn't the full story. Who is making all of this possible? The answer is the men and women on the ground who work around the clock to take this project, which was once just an idea, and make it a reality. My name is Emily and I'm a heliostat technician. The best part of my job is being able to do something for my hometown. I've got two daughters, one's five and a half and one's freshly 14. It's a wonderful opportunity for Tonopah. It's what everything is revolving around right now. <laughs> it's mom's job, so it's, it's pretty cool. And my name is Don Johnson. I'm a code welder here at the solar reserve plant. The most difficult part is probably making sure every weld is 100% code weld. Code weld means it's within a specific code when they x-ray every weld. And when they look at that, they see whether or not there's any imperfections in the weld. If there's any imperfections whatsoever, we cut it out and redo it. Yeah, my name is Bruce Gilmore. I'm a journeyman pipe fitter. I've been pipe fitting for roughly about 30 years. I was kind of thrilled when we got the opportunity to come out and do uh, solar energy, but this is the old beat to do, you know. I feel great to be out here being an old guy working on new technology. I go by Cowboy. I've got 200 plus people that work for me on this project to make sure that everybody's doing their job safely is probably the most stressful part of this job. On a normal work week, we're anywhere between 85 to 95 hours a week. I'm at work uh, at 4 o'clock in the morning every morning and I get off about 7 o'clock at night. Uh, the best part of my job here is being able to build a solar plant that's going to help our nation stay green. Well, I've been building nuclear power plants, coal-fired power plants. Uh, the way of the future seems to be able to use the sun to harvest it. Future generations will be thankful that we're able to start getting smart enough and stop polluting the environment. The Crescent Dunes Solar Energy Project isn't just a faceless corporate venture. It is a labor of love by people who believe in what they're doing and want the plant to succeed. This project would not be possible without the hard work and dedication of these men and women who are working for a better tomorrow, a day where we are no longer dependent on fossil fuels. Hey, on TV, baby. <laughs>